shall perish. God's word for you. Let us pray. This morning, our kind heaven Father, we come to you this morning with so many things given in our heart. We're watching over us all last week and now we may come to our house one more time. Father, well, that's enough for us to tell you thank you. Father, you've been good to us. You've been better to us than we have been to ourselves. And Father, right now, we ask you to bless this service and have it to be what you want it to be. Bless the one that is here. Bless the one that's on the way. And bless the one that's going to come to an end of So, Father, we ask you to just put your arm around and protect us from all the way to our name. And, Father, we ask a special blessing upon the young children today, Father. So, we do you appreciate it. Thank you, Zen. They wait. So, I did them to death. Look up to you and keep them from getting involved in things that is true. Father, we ask you to bless the one that's in the heart of Pastor. Bless the one that's saved. When you pray, pray for me. Father, we ask you to get blessed and prospered. And bless your heart. Let your light shine down on the Father so we can feel your own spirit today. Our Father, we ask you to say thank you, thank you, thank you. In the mighty name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. Amen. Thank you. 
good and precious gifts that come from above. We pause again, dear God, to tell you thank you. Thank you for just being God beside me there is no one. Thank you for your love, mercy, and grace, thy darling Son Jesus, and thy precious Holy Ghost God. Thank you for enabling us to assemble thee and do prostrate one more time. Not because we've been good, but because you've been good to us. And Father God, we call just to say that. I ask now in the name of God that you would hide me behind the cross. That Lord, you will be seen and less me. Let me minimize and you maximize. Let me decrease and you increase. Speak to me and through. Dear Father, I ask you that, that you would open the hearts and minds of your people up. Help us to receive the word. Father God, not my will, but let thine holy will be done. All these blessed requests we ask in Jesus' name. Saints of God say, Amen. Amen. And amen. Certainly give it thanks to God for our being here. Thanks to our Lord and our Savior Jesus Christ, and thanks to the precious Holy Ghost, our Comforter and our Guide. Recognize the Reverend Smith, Reverend Tadish, First Lady Taylor, officers, visiting officers, the Bailey members, visitors, and friends, to summon our love to all of God's children. It is indeed another one of God's blessings to enable us to be in the house of the Lord our God one more time. He looked beyond our fault. Somebody say he didn't see him. Yes, he did. He looked beyond our faults. And he supplied our need. Somebody laid down last night and get up this morning. Somebody laid down, got woke up this morning and couldn't move. But God, being a good God, he allowed our golden moments to roll on a little while longer. Not because we've been good, but because he's been good to us. Can I get a witness here? The Lord has brought us not part of the way, but he brought us all of the way. And as the song about it said, down through the year, down through the year, the Lord been good to me. Amen. We're going to be brief today. I tried to hold you too long. Uh, I don't want to make you happy twice, but glad twice. Glad to see me get up. Glad to see me sit down. I want to call your attention, thank you, Dickie, to the book of John, uh, the next chapter. Beginning with the very first verse. If y'all want me to preach, say preach. preach. All right. I heard some people say preach. The Lord help me, we'll preach. The book of John, the next chapter. Get your mind off of everything else. Put your mind on worshiping the Lord today. Lifting his name. He said if I be lifted up. I will draw all men unto me. When they lifted my channel on Calvary, the first one was the thief on the right. Y'all better pray, me. John, the ninth chapter, beginning with the very first verse. If you're there, give me a hearty amen. amen. If you're still looking, just say, wait a minute, tall preacher. Okay, I didn't hear nobody say, wait a minute. So I'm assuming everyone has the next chapter of John, uh, beginning with the very first verse. I will be reading, I'm trying to take my time here, from the King James Version. And as Jesus passed by, he saw a man which was blind from his birth. And his disciples asked him, saying, Master, who did sin? This man, or his parents, that he was born blind. Jesus answered, Neither has this man sinned nor his parents, but that the works of God should be made manifest in him. I must work the works of him that sent me while it is day. The night cometh when no man can work. As long as I am in the world, I am the light of the world. And when he had thus spoken, he spit on the ground and made clear the spill. And he anointed the eyes of the blind man with the clay. And said to him, Go wash in the pool of Siloam, which he was by interpretation sent. He went his way therefore and washed and came seen. The name was therefore and they which before had seen him that he was blind, said, Is this 
not he that said in vain. Some said, this is he. Others said, he is like him. But he said, I am he. Therefore said there in him, how were thine eyes open? He answered and said, a man that is called Jesus made clay out of none of mine eyes. And said unto me, go to the pools alone and wash. And I went and washed, and I received sight. God's word to the saints of God, God's word is already blessed. He said, a man that is called Jesus. What I want to talk about, I know it was Jesus. I know it was Jesus. I know it was Jesus. Not what somebody else said. Not what somebody else told you, but I know it was Jesus. All right? My brothers and sisters in Christ, I want to talk about this today because in this world that we are living in is a world that filled with temporary provisions. I want to say that again. In this world, that never wrong the world, but in this world that we are living in is a world filled with temporary provisions. There's nothing of this world that will last forever. Hello, somebody. Uh, clothes don't last. Eyeglasses don't last. Cars don't last. Houses don't last. Food don't last. There's nothing in this world that lasts forever. Hello, talk to me here. But there is one. Man called Jesus. He's the only provision that will last forever. Amen. Hello, somebody talk to me here. Amen. It doesn't matter, my brothers and sisters in Christ, what you are dealing with this morning or what you are going through. Let me remind you that Jesus is a life changer. Amen. Can I get a witness? Amen. When you don't have Jesus, in your life, you're like a ship. Help me preach here without a sail. Is that right? Come on, talk to me here. Uh -huh. I didn't the last. The, the, the vehicle that spoke with these sister table that he could not. Uh -huh. The back of the camera act like he didn't want to work the other day. There's nothing that lasts forever. Bridges on the road are falling down. Hello, somebody. Nothing lasts forever. For the wards is our sister are messing up. Y'all gonna talk to me here. But everything that Jesus made, everything that he provided, is still there. Without Jesus in your life, I'm gonna be brief here. Y'all wanna catch on here. Without Jesus in your life. You're just like a ship without a sail. The songwriter says, without God, I can do nothing. Without God, my life would fail. Without God, every preacher joy, my life would be rough, just like a ship without a sail. I don't know about you, but I'm leaning and depending on Jesus. Ain't anybody depending on him? I'm trusting in him every day. I'm waiting, just waiting for my sake. Because one of these days, he's going to dry all of my tears. Can I get over this here? Uh, I would rather have Jesus than silver and gold. Come on, talk to me here. Mark 8 and 36 says, For what shall it profit a man? If he shall gain the whole world and lose his own soul. Is that all right? As I began to look at this message, I'm going to be brief here. Is that all right, Brother Tom? Uh, I was laying in my bed. Uh -huh, beside the album. Mm -hmm. And uh, it laid on my heart three things to talk about from this message. And a lot of times, we want something that we can remember. Uh, it was laid on my heart. He saw. He said. And he did. Come on, preacher George. As the Bible says, and as Jesus passed by, he saw. Come 
want to talk to me. A man which was blind from his birth. Now, just as he saw a man which was blind from birth, he saw Nathaniel under the fig tree. He saw Zacchaeus up in a sycamore tree. Come on, somebody. He saw me when I was up. And he saw me when I was down. All right. He saw me when I was wrong. And he saw me when I was right. right he saw you when you were wrong. Yeah, and he saw you when you were right. Yeah. Is that all right? all right? But man looks on the outward appearance. Can I preach it But God looks on the heart. Yeah. Is that all right? But most of all, uh-huh. I praise God uh, that he saw the best in me. Can I get a witness here? When everyone else around could only see the worst in me. I wish I had a witness today. I'm just glad that uh, he saw the best in you. When other folks root you off and said that you would never make it. But he saw the best in me. <laughs> yeah, Lord. Is there anybody here that is thankful this morning that God did not write you off? Aren't you glad he did not throw you away? Aren't you glad that he picked you up and he saw Says and when disciples uh, 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 asked him, saying, Master, who did sin, this man or his parent, that he was born by? Now, now, the disciples, so many times, man draw their own conclusion about people. Pretty boy. Joe, number Joe, Joe's friend drew their own conclusion about Joe's sin. Can I get some help here? On the day of Pentecost, son, when it was fully come, some drew their own conclusion. Saying these men are full of new wine. But Peter, standing up with the eleven, lifted up his voice and said to them, These are not drunken as you suppose, seeing that it's but the third hour of the day. Pray for it. Uh, sometimes people will draw the wrong conclusion. The disciples said, Master, please boy, uh, who did sin, uh, this man or his parents, that he was born blind? Uh, they only they didn't need room for nothing else. Please boy, they knew that they were right in what they were saying. Is that all right? They left no reason uh, why the man was blown blind other than the man or his friend. Uh, when people are down, uh, instead of praying for them, uh, they want to know, other uh, folks, uh, what happened to them. Uh, instead of saying, Lord, uh, why don't you bless brother, sister, so-and-so. Uh, when people are down uh, and are sick, uh, other folks want to know, uh, how did they get sick? Uh, why What's wrong with them? Uh, well, I start by to tell you, uh, if they sink, uh, that's what's wrong with them. Uh, uh, they are sick. Uh, ain't God all right? Uh, but I want you to know that uh, a lot of times, uh, the enemies uh, don't want to see uh, nothing good happen to you. Uh, they are labeled. Uh, uh, what's wrong with you? Uh, on their own mind. Uh, but my Bible uh, uh, tell me, told us not to judge. I ain't God all right. I got to leave you here. But my Bible tell me that he saw and then not only did he see, but he spoke. Jesus answered and said, neither this man sin nor his prayers, but that the works of God should be made manifest in him. I must work, uh, the works of him that sent me, uh, a while in this day, uh, the night coming, uh, but no man can work, uh, Jesus is saying, uh, and you and I uh, must work the works uh, of him 
that sinners, ha, a wine in his day, ha, the night coming, ha, when no man can work, ha, and no man on the ha, I am in the world, please go on, I am, ha, the light of the world, ha, and God alright, ha, I want you to know, ha, the first thing, ha, he saw, ha, and then he spoke, ha, and God alright, ha, not only that, ha, did he see, ha, and did he speak, ha, but he did something, ha, the Bible said, ha, when he had thus spoken, ha, he spit on the ground, and made his lips to spill, ha, another the blind man eyes, ha, with the clay, ha, and God alright, ha, told him, ha, to go watch, ha, in the pool of so low, ha, ain't God alright, ha, I got to leave you here, ha, and the man went, ha, and watched, ha, but he became seen, ha, ain't God alright, ha, I want you to know, ha, we need to be, ha, obedient, ha, under God's word, ha, whatever, ha, the Lord say do, ha, of that we, ha, I need to do, ha, with the Lord say stand, ha, we ought to stand, ha, with the Lord say shout, ha, we ought to shout, ha, with the Lord say lift your head, and give him some glory, ha, you ought to lift your head, and tell the Lord, ha, I praise God, for his blessing, ha, thank God.
what I sold. 